Howdy, I'm TJ with Bear Gaming. Welcome to day 37. All right, so uh, inventory has restocked for the traders, so we're going to head that way now. I'm rocking the sniper rifle because of screamers. I did a little digging into how the screamers and the heat map work now in uh, 1.0, and it seems like uh, you do build heat. It is relegated to each chunk or 16 by 16 square of the map. But the possibility to spawn in a Screamer occurs when you hit 25% heat. So they happen more frequently. It's also possible that once you get to 25, they won't spawn, but the heat will still increase. With ever-increasing odds that they do spawn as you get close to 100. And once you hit 100, it happens. Uh, it's also possible for the timer to reset once you get past 25. So after about 25% heat, they can either reset Keep going or spawn. So we're going to keep the sniper rifle on us from now on. Uh, we're going to forego stealth entirely. I'm going to see what you got, dude. So he's got nothing I want. Uh, like at all. Yeah, I don't have any sugar butts either. Oh, he didn't have any. Uh, I don't think I have any back at base. So we're going to skip our wreck. I'm going to go grab the enforcer glasses because I forgot them in my haste. And we'll head over to the other wreck and see what he's got for us. Yeah, so every time you take a shot with a gun, or even the robotic turret, it increases the heat a little bit. Same thing with dew collectors, campfires, forges, all that fun stuff. And once it gets to a certain level, they will spawn. And that goes for each chunk. So a 16 by 16 square here, I can do it. And then I can walk that way and do it again, and then walk that way and do it again. There is a cooldown timer associated with each activity. So when the screamer spawns, It'll take a while for everything to settle back down where it can build heat again. That's why I've been getting them almost daily. But even right now, I've got one dew collector here, and I've got four over there. So it's it's just building heat right now. Yeah, so from now on, moving forward, once the screamer spawns, sniper rifle to the face. She's got to go down, and her twin sister, because there's equal odds that either one or two show up. Yeah, they got to go down first, and then we should be able to handle just about anything else that throws at us. And if they start stacking because we're in a bad spot and they see us before we can shoot them, we may have to deal with them in a different manner. Let's get to the other wreck. All right, we've arrived at wreck number two. Get inside. If you guys want me to go in-depth, make a guide video on heat, uh, leave a comment down below. I'll be happy to do so. If you want a more in-depth discussion. Dang, he didn't have any either. Happy? I gotta take her unless you're paying, you're leaving. Yeah, whatever, dude. He doesn't want to shovel. How dare he take my shovel? Uh, a couple of auto shotguns, a junk magnum, another vulture, everything we've sold to him. Eh, we can wait. Be careful out there. Ah, I don't even know if we want to go to Jen now, you know? I mean, it's restock day, but the only thing we really want is a sniper rifle, and I can make a better one make a two i do need to mine a lot more i think that's more important we'll hold off on getting gin and bob so we need paper i need more lead i need clay and nitrate and coal so we'll head back to base i'll get my mining equipment maybe deal with a screamer when we get there because i got everything going and then i have decided since the robotic turrets can spawn a screamer uh, we should probably not use two We'll just keep one on us. And then I'm making a second one, but we're going to put it on the top of the Blood Moon base just to deal with the birds so I don't have to keep looking away. I think that would be a wiser move. Let's get to work. If any screamers show up, I'll let you know. Well, it's not a screamer, but it is a wandering horde. Let's take care of it real quick. Yeah, survivor. All right, we got a good amount of nitrate. We got a lot of clay for the forge, so we're going to head back. We'll see if we get a screamer in. We'll get everything set back up, and then we got to go back out and about. All right, I got a bit of time. 
So let's do a couple of trader quests for Bob. Let's see if we can get to tier four again. Uh, I'm not certain how far away we are from tier four. And then I think uh, the plan moving forward, I need to find a spot or make a spot that's kind of far away from the base. And I need to fill it with dew collectors so I can start mass producing paper for shotgun turret ammo. And then we're going to expand the farm the next chance we get after the next uh, super corn harvest. So hopefully that'll be day 38. So I'm, we're stopped struggling with shotgun ammo because I'm still sh struggling to get shotgun ammo together. What it is, Bob? It's good to see a familiar face. You're looking at the right hombre, partner. So you say? Yeah, junk. Got solar cells, which we're probably never going to use. You must have short arms and deep pockets. Uh, what's close? Scarecrow fields. Jobs. Have a look. Well, that's better than a sharp stick in the eye. Yeah, we'll see what that's about. Excuse me, sir. I have a job to do. Ah, yes. I vaguely remember this place. I'm going to steal all your corn before I start this sucker up. Don't mind me. Dude, you didn't water your potatoes. They died. Let's begin. We got to stay within. Find the supplies. Easy, right? I bet not. See, magazines like this are only worth 20, so we're going to scrap those to get the paper. Hello? Oh, over here. Oh man, it's a cop. Yeah, cop gotta go down first. He's floaty. Barrel? One. Oh no, he's entered the door. Or the wall. It's okay, I rescued him. Yeah, you know, I do need probably something for stealth. I should probably keep carrying the crossbow too. Didn't even think about that. Oh, green dude. Be gone. Yeah, I need to probably remove one of these and put on the rad remover mod. You know, I'm moving through here at a kind of leisurely place. I should probably start picking the speed up a little bit. Because I still have to fix the base. Bad zombie. Bad. Did I walk past the stupid... Oh, I think it's over in the barn. Come here, robot. I need you. Go down, dude. The baton's doing better today. Probably should have reloaded it. Didn't think about that. Look your head through. I hear. Do you hear? Unfortunately, we're kind of stuck in here. If I can get her before she screams. I don't think she screamed yet. Another one. Getting laggy.
All right, uh, I'm gonna do this real quick. They will get in here. I need a means of uh, quick escape. Like that. Oh, we didn't find the supplies. We gotta stay inside. I did a dumb. I didn't get to the supplies. We may fail this one. Ow. Oh yeah, there's a lot of them. Yeah, it's upstairs too. Well, I don't know what to do here. I didn't grab the supplies, so it's not like I can just skedaddle with it. I, mean, I have enough ammo to deal with them, but I'm just not apparently quick enough. If she keeps calling them in, we gotta go. I'm gonna fail it. Yeah, this this is why the 25% thing is stupid. And she just keeps screaming and bringing them in. Yeah, there's still a bunch of them standing over by the barn. I mean, if we can do this, I think we'll be okay. Yeah, we needed that health boost. Oh, we got both of them. That is so big. Uh, I don't know if there was another one over there, so we're going to have to be... Yep. Maybe out of screams, though. Keep it going. I'm just concentrating, so it's going to be a bit quiet. Do a death scream now. Dang, that took a while to charge. So we're approaching 1800 hours. I mean, I think it should be enough time to go back and fix everything. As long as we finish up here soon. Yeah, I still hear one. We got another? Oh, 
Oh, I didn't even see. Yeah, I don't know if she keeps screaming him in or what. Because it looks like it. I heard another one behind me. Yeah, she keeps screaming him in. There's no way. We don't have enough time. And it's upstairs. I'd have to run upstairs. Yeah. Mission over. Just keep screaming and they keep spawning in. We're done. We have no time. We've got to head back to base and fix everything. I mean, I might be able to get the main stash if we evacuate the area for a little bit. But that's the warning to get back to base. Oh, that stinks. That stinks. I mean, this way you can't you can't use the turret like at all because it's immediately. I mean, if you use it more than twice, it's going to spawn everything in. Let's cruise back a little bit and see if we can't pick them off and at least grab the main stash. Because I mean, quest progression aside, I still need that main stash. Come. Here she is. She's still screaming people in. Yep, because they weren't there before. Yeah, evacuate. There's no point. We'd have to wait too long. We gotta get back to base and fix everything. That's aggravating. All right, on the off chance, we've got one here, too. I don't think so, but then again, I'm not certain. All right, let's take this time and fix everything. I just, I don't know what to do about the Screamers. I really don't. Every time they show up, I'm stuck. I only have got 77 shotgun shells, man. I don't have enough to get through the Blood Moon. And I haven't had a chance to make paper. We're so screwed. This is going to be a tough one. All right, let's focus up, I guess. All right, everything's I think, prepped and ready to go. I think I got everything. Um, so I only have enough ammo for one turret. The other one is completely empty, which stinks. But I do have the robotic turret on the roof, so that should cover birds. Uh, you know what? We'll hold on that. Missed. Got her. What's the odds they don't throw like a bunch of cops at us right at the beginning? Low, right? Go down, dude. Sound like the turret's doing his job. Good. Yeah, as for like the uh the screamers, I don't I don't know what I'm gonna do. It's almost like I can't use my turrets anymore, because if I use the turret twice, they show up. Same thing with mining, I can't make a big mine because they show up. So I have to do small ones every once in a while. I mean if that's what I gotta do, that's what I gotta do, but I gotta be ready for it, you know? I can't just keep leaving the area every time. I get two Screamers to spawn in, and then they show up two more. And each one of those show one or two. Not sustainable, you know? More birds coming in. Let's see how it goes. No, well, that one didn't get it. Still going. Dude, you again? Fighters are getting aggravating. My aim seems to be worse tonight. Yeah, I'm going to hold on using the shotgun turret for a little while. I want them to break the fences down first. 
When they start stacking up top pretty heavy, then we'll do it. I do know how to make the two times scope now, so we're definitely going to do that uh, tomorrow. I'd like to aim this a little bit better. I was waiting for you to show up. Alright, day 38. Now, I don't have a whole lot of ammo. I got a good amount. We don't have a surplus anymore. Turret. Got him. Like that, though. Quickly now, quickly. Protect your friend. They're not far enough up, I can't hit them. Hopefully there's a lot of bags in the tunnel, because there ain't hardly any down there. Oh, we got a radiated. I don't know how he's going to do in the tunnel. I'm sure he'll make it pretty far. He does heal. I just don't know if his healing negates the shock. Like if the damage evens out. I don't know. Alright, they're piling up. Oh, that's for sure a cop. Where's he at? What in the world? Oh, is that a radiated vulture? Yeah, that's might what that bit have been. Oh, kill right complete. Yeah, that's what we'll hit the trader for tomorrow. We'll uh, collect those two challenges. He got no arm no more. Are we approaching the end? Yeah, it looks like we hit the number 3 a.m. again. All right, let's get some repairs in, and then we'll uh, check the bags. All right. Head down and see what we got. Uh, decent amount, decent amount. Ooh, we can make the impact driver. That's good. Because we're going to need lots of electrical parts today. So they cleared... Got two fences down here. Lots of bags in here. Yeah, good amount. Time charge is nice. This enforcer outfit. Sniper quality three. Ammo. Put this ammo in the turret real quick. Yeah, not not a whole lot of bags today. It's like the corn's ready. That is good because we need lots of glue. Doesn't look like a whole lot of actual physical base damage, which is good. Just a lot of crap repair again. There it is, 4 a.m. day 38, official end of the Blood Moon. Not as productive as I would have liked, but not bad. This one's uh, a little more than half full. This one's completely empty, but we do have about 200 rounds crafting back at base. Uh, not a whole lot of loot this time. That's probably because we got some more aggressive zombos. 
which is to be expected at this stage of the game. Uh, boom. So all we have left is inventory management. I don't, again, know what I'm going to do about the Screamers. We've got to figure something out. I'd like to use my turrets, but if I use it twice in one chunk, we have a 1 in 4 chance of spawning one, which is aggravating. Yeah, shotgun ammo. Dump chest real fast. And then we got to remember to grab our turret on the top of base. So I'll ponder what to do about Screamers. Because it's got to get dealt with. Um... If that means we have to stop using the turret, we have to stop using the turret. It's just what it is. It stinks because I do enjoy my turrets. So I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please leave a like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And if you have, thank you. I greatly appreciate it. Until next time. Laters. Survived another night, but what will tomorrow bring? All we can do is prepare. Are you ready for the next horde?